So I got everything um, squared, tight, as can be on this upper, which was loose before. And I'm going to install a muzzle brake. The muzzle brake I'm going to be installing is the VG6 uh, Epsilon. This is the new one by them. I don't, I don't know why the camera's not. There we go. Um, most people think that since the logo's on top, this goes on top. Actually, it's called for the slits on top and these holes on the bottom. But installing a muzzle brake is like any others. I got a crush washer there, but before I do anything, I usually like to use a little bit of rock set over there. Roll up my sleeves just to get those threads nice and clean all the way at the end. All right. All right. Take my crush washer. The bevel position is this way. So the bevel goes out because we're going to crush. Come on, focus, man. We're going to crush that side in. All right. We'll bevel it out pretty much. All right. Take my rock set. Hey, one second, let me make, make a hole. Sorry about that. All right. Just a dab. Okay. And I'm pretty much screw this on, muscle brake on. Get all those threads with all that rock set back and forth. All right, and I'm pretty much there. I want to go once around because I can crush this. And once I get to the 11:30 position, I'll re I'll resume for you guys. So right now it's 11:30 position. I'm gonna make sure everything is tight. Making sure this thing is straight is the worst part. This is the wife's job. <laughs> Just stand in front of it. Looks pretty good. All right, and that's it. I don't recall how much you have to wait. Does it say? Instructions, 15 minutes, 170 for 15 minutes. You should wait and that's it for rock set. There you go, right on the bottom. But upper is done, that's it. Um, I'm gonna put the bolt in, charging handle, and that should be, you should be good to go. But that's how you put it, that's how I install my muzzle brakes, simple. Just eye it out. Alright guys, thanks for watching.